Ooh. Christ, do not fall, please. I do not need eight years, bad luck. In me size, and they were four pound. Four pound! So nice. Let us just show you the arse. Hi, honey buns. It's Demi. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Or if you're just joining us now, welcome. <coughs> Woo! Welcome! What the fuck is that pitch? Welcome! Just call me Celine Dion. Okay guys, I am super duper excited for this video because I'm going to be doing a Primark haul. I recently went to Primark and I did do a come shop with me. I'm not sure if it'll be up before or after this video. So if it's not up, keep your eyes peeled. And if it is up, I hope you've watched it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a Primark haul. Now, I didn't get... I didn't get as much as I wanted to get, to be honest. For not going to Primark in quite a long period of time, I expected to spend that money. But I didn't spend as much as I kind of anticipated to. They just didn't have stuff that was appealing to us. So, what I've done is this is going to be a Primark haul, but to kind of make it a little bit more worth your while, I'm going to show you how I'd style all of the items as well. So, it's going to be like a styling haul. Bring them back then. And I haven't done a haul in a while either. So this is like the first haul on my channel in a while. However, ASOS have got some banging things that I really want at the minute. So maybe we'll have an ASOS haul coming as well. So have Sheen. Sheen have got some absolutely gorgeous things. So you might have hauls from them coming very soon if I take the plunge and buy what's in me basket. Anyway, today we're just going to be starting with Primark. I really hope you enjoy this video. If you'd like to continue to see haul videos, Primark videos, whatever else, let us know by giving this one a thumbs up. So subscribe down below and let's get into the video okay guys so this is the first item that i picked up it's one of them kind of like swishy tie-dye looking dresses now i've seen these all over pretty little thing and i was quite surprised to see this one in primark now it was 20 pound and i'm wearing it in a size 18 this is what it looks like now it is a bodycon so it is going to really hug you at the stomach so if that's something that you feel you would be conscious about, then this probably wouldn't be the dress for you. Because I feel like it does accentuate your stomach a little bit. Um, but it does have kind of ruffles all the way down it in the middle. Which I feel like is quite cute. Now it is quite an out there dress for me. And maybe not something I'd like traditionally pick up. But I really vibe with it. I feel like it's modern. I feel like it's quite trendy. And I actually feel really pretty in it. I feel like it's a pretty dress now. Bonus points from me because I do love a long arm. I have an insecurity of the top of my arms. Not sure why. It's just a bloody arm. But it's an insecurity. I just feel like sometimes the top of my arm doesn't look that great. So I feel like this... With the long arm, really does just like look quite nice, cute. I feel like it. I feel like it flatters me figure. To be fair, even though it does cling to me stomach, I don't actually think it looks that bad. I feel like it's quite cute. Now the back does just look like this, so there's nothing really much going on at the back. Um, but yeah, and like I said, it does have a little collar, which I'm not sure how well you can say, but it does have a little collar as well. So what I've paired it with is gold accessories as I usually would me necklace me earrings this little white bag which is actually from monkey my friend Caitlin got us it and I love it so much and then I've paired it with some brown sandals personally just because I didn't have any white ones I thought black would be too much so I thought some nudie brown ones which are actually from Primark as well but I didn't get them this time round so I'm not sure if you'll still be able to get a hold of them overall I think this is quite a cute outfit definitely something I'd wear for a night out you know wanting to go out out and I feel like it's quite a Rusty's outfit like you will see me in Rusty's dancing in this outfit if you're not from Newcastle Rusty's is like a bar within the gay scene in town it's the best bar ever I love it so much but yeah I'm very happy with this dress I'm definitely going to be keeping it and like I said out there for me colour wise and style wise not something I'd usually pick up but hey, step out your comfort zone once in a while because I have found myself a little gem. Guys, who the hell am I? I have totally gone all Instagram vibes with this outfit. Ooh, ooh. Okay, I actually really love it. This is a perfect autumn winter outfit if you ask me. Right, so the only item I'm actually trying to show you is the pants because they're the ones from Primark. But they are worth every bloody penny now i don't know about you but i love nothing more than an outfit that includes a comfortable pant a comfortable bottom half is what i need in life because i've i've discovered more recently every time i'm pairing an outfit together and i put jeans on i do not vibe with the jeans i 
hate them. I despise them. But comfy pants are my best friend. So these are cotton trousers. Now, to be fair, they could pass as pajama bottoms, but they weren't in the jammy bottom section. But they're just black, high waisted, wide leg, and they fit amazingly. Like, so nice. Let us just show you the arse. Look at that. They have just got such a gorgeous fit about them. They just flatter is so nice. So you could wear them like just everyday wear casual joggers, you know. But if you wanted to actually style them, I've gone for a little racer crop top. This one is ripped pattern and it's actually from Pretty Little Thing. Then I've gone for this teddy fleece trench style coat i think that's what it's called god look at me trying to be a little fashionista yeah i think this is a trench style coat but i'm sure someone will correct us if i'm wrong i feel like the length makes this like a really smart outfit and then i've just got a fake louis vuitton bag on i got this from it'll either be vova or it'll be when i went away to like lanzarote but yeah i feel like the black and brown really goes nicely and then my friend katie when i was down in london i literally never took these sunglasses off I love them so much and she let us have them which I think are from ASOS because I've recently seen them on ASOS so I'm going to link these are very similar to these below for years because I know a lot of people ask for them but yeah anything that's not from Primark that I can link below I will try to but yeah this is what the full outfit looks like and I'm just getting total autumn winter vibes although would you wear sunglasses in autumn winter well you know it could be argued probably not but it's an accessory isn't it and I really like it so this is the outfit not gonna lie i'm giving myself a 10 out of 10 so simple but i think i look cute and i think i really styled these pants nicely if i say so myself so well done to me jesus guys don't say i don't do things for you i'm going all out in this haul look at this man fashionista number two right so the main item of this bit is the top so this is actually one of the Primark thin knitwears. They're like jumpers. They do them every single year. And I literally love them. I have this exact white one upstairs that I've worn to death. It's got a hole in the collar. I layer it and everything. I love it so much. I decided to pick up this one. But I also picked it up in... So I've got this in an XL. Oh, by the way, I forgot to tell you. Is I've got the pants in an 18. But I picked it up in the cream. And then also picked it up in the black. Which I'm not going to style because you'll see two ways that i would style one of these but i picked it up in the black in an xl and then this color which is a beige but i'm going to style this one next for you i feel like a lot of the stuff i got basics but i feel like basics are necessity aren't they like you need the basics anyway so this is this one it's just a long sleeved high neck jumper it's very thin it has got a slight ribbed material to it this is what it looks like it is ribbed now they are a little bit sheer and not the best of quality fucking hell the mirror christ do not fall please i do not need eight years bad luck now they are a little bit sheer but they are primark quality so that would kind of be expected in my opinion and now i've paired it with i've kept the pants on because i feel like it shows you another way that you could style these pants which i really like i've kept the beige trousers on beige trousers the beige trainers on because i feel like they go quite well maybe they'd go better if they were cream but i don't own cream trainers so we're gonna have to go with the beige ones and then i've put this kind of black leather feel jacket on now this i believe is from nasty gal i think but i'll link it below and then i have these little cat eye sunglasses which i love sunglasses i think feel the makers look so bougie like who is she bougie 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 anyway this is outfit number three i really love this one again it's something that i think i'll be wearing quite a lot of such an easy item to throw together but i feel like it makes you look like you've really made an effort so this one's getting a yes from me as well here's another one of the jumper turtlenecks which is such a go-to outfit for me with a little cami dress a belt this belt's from pretty little thing but a while ago i'll try and link a similar one this jacket i love these jackets i've got it in nearly every single color it's from nasty gal and i love it so much i feel like they're such a boxy cute I haven't made an effort but i've made an effort type of fit i love them um I, like i said i've literally got it in every color because i just love them so much but yeah this is another way that you could style them little jumpers i feel like this is such a gorgeous outfit and i really like all the colors together i feel like they really match nice i mean you might say otherwise but i think they look pretty nice 
I think I look pretty good, yeah? I would style this outfit with a pair of little boots just because I think that would be really cute. Yeah, I'm getting good, aren't I? Like, I'm really trying with these outfits and I love them. I need to look back on this video when I don't know what to wear and just pick one of these outfits because I feel they all look really nice. Okay, guys, I really wanted a jogger set that I could wear out that was, like, quite trendy. Couldn't find one. I seen this pair of jammies in Primark and I thought, well, you... Do not look like jammies to me. You look too good to be a pair of pyjamas. So, I've styled it up. Now, yes, it's jammies. If you feel like you wouldn't want to go out in that, fair enough. But I would, okay? Because I feel like styled up, this doesn't look like jammies. Now, I have put heels on it because I say on all the fashion websites, people are putting heels with joggers. And in all honesty, I just think it looks a bit crap. So, the heels are going. Not them. But, if we put on... Me trainers just for comfort you know comfort that's so true as well like i understand the fashion websites dressing up uh like joggers to make it look like oh you can go out in this as well it's comfy but really if you're wearing a jogger it's because you want to be comfortable so why would you want to wear heels because they are not comfortable do you know what i mean like it's not very logical to me anyway i've paired it with yeah this is mint excuse me can you see me right now so this is actually jammies from primark it's a pair of long trousers that cuff at the bottom they're so relaxed so soft and then a hooded top to me perfect little cord for going out to you if you want to just be like no that is simply just jammies fair enough but i think more of it than that i really do like, look at me. I look trendy as heck. I want to show you the other bits that I got that I'm not actually going to style. So, I also picked up this. No, they're my pants. E, I'm such a mess. I just picked up a standard high neck turtleneck bodycon. Again, I'd style this many ways. Ways that I've probably showed in this video already. That's why I'm not going to bother style it. And then, I've been wanting some Crocs. Everyone's got them, so I want them. Well, Primark had fake Crocs. So I thought we'll test the waters and I'll get the fake Crocs to see if I actually will wear them. I don't feel comfortable wearing them out. Because that ugly shoe stigma from when they first come out still sticks with me. So from now on, the house shoes. But we'll see. Maybe I'll get the confidence to wear them out. But yeah, I got some fake Crocs from Primark in my size and they were £4. £4! That's a bloody bargain! Bloody hell! Might not even bother buying the real ones. Four pound. Anyway, this is me little fake Crocs. I hope you like them. That's everything that I got. Okay, guys, so that is everything that I got from Primark. I really hope you enjoyed this video. What was your favourite outfit? Tell us in the comments below. And today's secret word is going to be happy because i'm feeling very happy today and i want to spread all the happiness and positive energy to you guys so let's all comment happy in the comments below along with telling us your favorite outfit from today's video because i feel like when there's a secret word i don't actually get like comments where i can like talk to you as well so tell us your favorite outfit as well okay and then just add happy into it okay thanks so much for watching and i'll see you again soon for another one bye